Hey friends, it's Joe from Swing This Kettlebell and Strength, and we're going to talk about getting stronger with kettlebells. So, biggest thing here is when people say they can't get stronger or they can't build muscle by using kettlebells, chances are they're not lifting heavy enough, okay? So, this is something that I do often, and I call it the Outer Limits Protocol. It basically goes from th anywhere from 20 to 40 minutes on a clock, and there's a couple different variations you can do, but this is for heavy stuff. This is two 90 pound, these are Kettlebell King's fitness bells, um, but it's a clean and jerk on the minute, okay? So here's the thing, when someone tries to take, let's say, two 88 pound kettlebells, how many reps are they going to end up doing in a set? I'll tell you, it's not that much. Okay, personally, my best at the top of my strength and form with kettlebell um, was probably about 14 or 15 jerks. That's just jerks. Here's the difference with clean and jerk. It trains the whole body and it's just exhausting. But here is how I get so much more leg development by doing that dead stop that hike back clean, okay? So it's not straight from the ground. You can't see it in fast in time lapse, but that's the thing. Just to show the time lapse, this is 30 minutes. This is how this takes, okay? So I'm going every minute and just holding that bell up there, those bells up there for a couple seconds for stabilization and it just wears you out. Like I was getting to the point where I was so fatigued that each rep right there each repetition was taking all my effort to make sure that it was focused and safe. But I ended up with 5,400 pounds just by doing singles overhead. Okay, so clean and jerk. That's what's going to build a lot of muscle by using kettlebells. Yes, if you have two 53-pound kettlebells, you're not going to be able to build that much muscle. You're going to have to go for volume but if you get heavier bells, like I said, these are two 90-pound bells. It's 180 pounds and thrown around for a decent amount of heavy singles. All right? So if this helps you out, try to do something like this, maybe one every 30 seconds, one every 45 seconds, or even one every minute. Okay? It gives you plenty of time to recuperate. And check out my Outer Limits Protocol for pressing strength and overhead strength on my YouTube channel. And this is a little bit of it. So hope you enjoyed this time lapse. I know it was three minutes. Swing this.